This is Dusty. Taken on 7,918 zombies, survived for four months, three days, and 21 hours. We made it to the four month mark. Quick glance outside. Fill the water bottle, grab the soup. Tell you what, grab these cabbages as well, because we're going to go and set some traps. Looks like we might have some fog rolling in. Okay, so we got one trap down. Which we got a medium sized rabbit from. Right, give me my worms. Give me my cabbages. Oh, he's zombo. I think we need more traps, don't we? Cabbage in here. Another zombie coming. Right, we've got them trapped. Check the worms back in there. I don't know why I reversed all the way in. We're going straight back out. Rabbit in there. Cabbage in there. Electronics in there. Just had a screaming meta event there. But various pieces of twine on me as well. Alright, we're good to go. But I think we're turning down here. We got ourselves a zombo. Oh man, that was a gunshot meta event. What's with all the meta events today? The game's out to get me today. It's making it foggy. It's making meta events happen all over the place. It's gone. Right, four months. That's your lot, Dusty. But we'll see about that game. You idiot. Ooh, these are the guys coming to the gunshot. It's fine. I want to get them all anyway. You're just conveniently bringing them to me. Well, let's quickly eat some soup since we're hungry. Despite what the game says, you don't drink soup. You eat it. It's got pieces of rabbit and potato in that. You're not drinking potato, are you? What time should we sit down to drink our evening meal? Unless you're having a protein shake. You're eating that sucker. Yay, another lighter for the collection. Oh man, I like that look. The suit there. That's pretty cool. Yes, any more? Let's keep going. This girl did not get the memo to join the others. We'll help her out. Okay, there's a few around here. We have some coming from behind here. The way I came. Well, we've got this. What appears to be like a really tall zombie here. Can zombies vary in height? Or is everyone the same height in this world? Because that girl looked really tall. We don't need the key. It's just going to be melted rotten ice cream. Yeah, chips. Monkeys, meat sticks, that's what it's all about. Yeah, we've got so many vitamins, painkillers and stuff now. I stocked up last episode. So do go back and check that out if you happen to miss it. That's the type of thing you're supposed to say, isn't it? And we're making out here, we got. Loads of chips, meat sticks, jerky, Twinkies, chocolate, everything. No cash, I must have already been in here. Except, I haven't looted any of the shelves. Weird. Let's just chug an orange soda right now. I'm guessing there's a back room. Oh, some smokes. Jerky, chocolate, all the good stuff. This place is like a jackpot for a survivor. Okay, so we had some stuff on us coming in. But we got six jerky now. 8 chocolate, 28 bags of chips, that's great. Still got a coffee there. We've got 6 dehydrated meat sticks, 3 grill bars, 3 Twinkies, 140 cigarettes just from this place. We'll make sure the fanny pack's topped up there. Speaking of, we need smoke. Yeah, oh, this stack, eh? Which reminds me, there should be cigarettes here as well. Yes. And lighters. 
the collection. Go on, then. We've got 378 cigarettes just there. Wow. To go with the 2,000 or whatever it is we've got at home. I'm out in this area. Cafe Ole is very popular. It's always respawning. It's always got new customers in the door. They must have great lunchtime specials. Don't try and sneak up there, man. I saw you. Yeah, yeah, nice try. Get away from my van, girl. This way, zombs. Hey, you got one clever one. Going for the open gap. This creepy girl here just stood on her own. Staring off into the distance. Ooh, there's a little crowd up there, is there? Ooh! Closer than I realised. Look at these guys just appearing here. I was literally just there. Oh, the door's open there. That's weird. Unless I've been there before. Uh, so I think I can see where Cafe Ole's customers are coming from. Ah, uh, yes, I have been here before. They shouted into that door, I remember. But I'm not fully aware of what's behind me here, so I've got to double check. We're okay for now. So hopefully clearing out this car park will help fighting down the street. Woo. Girl, what are you doing? I'm right here. Ah, yeah, they've broken into the back door of Cafe Ole. That's what they've done. Ah, he's bald. He's wearing a cap because he's bald. I'm not going to stay in there. Tight quarters. Ah, oh, hence a knife. Alright, so that's where we were last episode. I'm just going to bring it all the way back now. Here. And see who we can take out. This way. Another bowl of soup, Dusty. Don't mind if I do. Look at this guy. Oh man, it's six o'clock. We need to head. Let's just give off a quick shout here. Then they can be there for next time. But yeah, it's about to get dark here. We need to go. Let's go. Wow, big crowd here. We'll get them tomorrow. Hmm. Pretty sure I just saw a zombie over here. Just around here somewhere? Ah, they're on the other side of the fence. Okay. I don't want to be messing with them. I thought they were on this side of the fence. Let's check that generator. 72 fuel, 98 condition. We'll probably fill that tomorrow. Right, let's quickly do our cooking and stuff then. It's 42... We'll have to not rub it, so no rabbit in the potato scrap salad tonight. We could use these cabbages, though. Sure, add a beef jerky to it. 2,307 cigarettes in there. They're the backups. We have 200 on us at all times. Two bowls for tomorrow. We also have 37 lighters in here. Three in a backpack and one on our person. Our weight is going down. Let's eat some chips and stuff. Here we go. Even out at 80. Perfect. 5.20. Man, that's an early wake-up. Nobody out there. Let's just grab, like, a few scrap electronics here. Grab a gas can. Info. Turn off. Fix. Add fuel. Turn on. Sorted. 
we are going to head down to traps. I think I'm going to make a couple more traps as well. Yeah, we've sorted these logs. Let's make three of the trap boxes. They look like they're slightly better. But we'll make three of them. Let my lesson. Didn't swerve out of the way. It's the last time I swerved out of the way. I hit a lamppost and had a fractured arm for like three weeks. Here we are. And we're not having much luck with these trap boxes, but still. Right, so there's a few more traps down. Check this one. Rub it. Right, so let's just get a couple of worms here. I'm going to keep putting worms in these ones. I want to catch a bird eventually. It's already bait in that one. We'll use cabbage for all the others. How's our trapping skill looking? Yeah, it's currently working on level four. Nearly crashed then looking at that. That's why I should always concentrate on the road. Whoa. Multiple, well, two zombies at least coming out of that place. Seems unusual. Man, it's foggy. Okay, there's one more over there. Anyone else lurking here? Doesn't look like it. There we go. So they go in there, that's fine. You go in there. Right, I guess we take a chance and head to Louisville in the fog and hope it clears up. By kind of midday. We're kind of close to getting into our location. So, fingers crossed we can make it in there. And then the fog won't be a factor. You know what's interesting? There's a wreck there. I'm pretty sure the big warehouse is like around here. I think this is it, in fact. If I can get a propane torch out of this. Oh no, this isn't the big warehouse. Never mind. This is the big warehouse right here. I think it's worth just popping our heads in. Because if I can get a propane torch, I can get rid of that stupid wreck. Some zombies here. These three girls here. Hello, ladies. What are you doing over here? I cleared this place out ages ago. Party's over. I certainly see one in there. See the legs. Oh, that's nice. Ridges of the fog. This one's working around now. Rather than be jump scared later, let's just take care of... The guy that looks like Bob Ross right now. I just want to check because I've got a memory of one of these shelving units just being full of propane torches. A couple of metal pipes there. Oh, do you know what? These metal sheets. I am going to take these as well. I believe you can use them to um, repair the trunk or the hood of your car, even. And goodness knows we need to do that. We want sacks. We want these sacks. Somebody in the comments give me a helpful tip. The sack just disappear? Oh, there it is. Okay. I see how that works now. Yeah, apparently putting the cabbages into sacks and then putting them in the freezer will mean we can fit more in. And I'm all for that. We'll grab a few sacks while we're here. I do listen to the comments when it comes to useful gameplay tips I can use to enhance what I'm already doing. If it's just use guns, it's a waste. Why aren't you using guns? Then, you know, that's not so helpful. That's just a playstyle choice. But if it's something like did you know you can put your cabbages into sacks in the freezer and fit more in? That's a great sort of tip. That's the sort of thing I love. Ooh, a lead pipe. Come here. There it is. That's the winner. Just realised we will need a welding mask for this as well. I am kind of now dependent on looting one of them. Ooh, I see a zombie. There's another propane torch. What's he doing there? There's welding rods. I find it hard to believe I took every single welding mask with me. But no luck on this occasion. Man, not a single welding mask to be had. Oh, we've got all these sacks, which is great. So not all bad. Whoops, I did not bring my soup. Yeah, I guess we're filling up in chips. I hear the zombies we spotted last time. Do you believe there was a few more on the corner? Yes, indeed. Where did you come from? Look at the state of your zombie. You're a mess. Go and have a wash. A couple of zombies waiting for Fun Extreme to reopen its doors here. Oh, is this for fun? How's this for extreme? Right, well, this is the clearest this run down here has been for a... Well, ever. Quite frankly. 
So that's clear progress being made. That's good. What have you got, girl? Enter knife, I bet. Yep. Hmm. He's all ready to start dancing like a flash mob or something over here. This must be where I shouted. Be somebody up there. Right, we've got these guys down here. Man, I love those chef trousers. Look at them. They're awesome. Get a shout. Let's get them all out. These are the things I could do without. Come on. I'm talking to you, zombies. Come on. Oh, yeah. Got a lead pipe, didn't we? Of course, now we're encumbered. Here we go. I do like the lead pipe. Out you come. Come on, zombos. Ooh, we're tired. You know what that means? We can finally drink this coffee. Been in my bag for about a month now. Right, remember purple shirt right by the van. Red knife. I'm guessing that's a bread knife. That actually looks like a bread knife. Yeah. Man, there's so many zombies in there. Well, half past six, we better head back. Just decided to go up a different street here. Out of curiosity. I mean, it's all very busy over here. I'm trying to work out where I've been and where I haven't. Oh, yeah, this bit with all the cars. We have been here, I believe. But it looks like it's kind of somewhat repopulated. Yeah, we've definitely been here. This is repopulated quickly. Wow. There's the Star Reflex. Where's the police station in conjunction to where we are now? Way back there. Okay. Yeah, hey, some more zombies outside the apartments. That's interesting. Wow, loads of zombies around here all of a sudden. Interesting. And we're back. Right, so what do we do? We put these. How do we... Ah, okay, I see. Slight problem, I can't actually get to the items on the floor. There we go. Um, so sack. I'm confused. Somebody said that you can fit more in, but it seems to be exactly the same. I had 150 cabbages in there. I've got 150 cabbages because 75 in each stack. But it's still filling up the freezer just the same. So I don't see how that's helped at all. Now we don't need to cook because I still have soup here that I didn't take with me today. But that's fine. Right, what I'm going to do with these sacks, I'm going to pick them up. I'm going to put them over here in this shelf. And if somebody in the comments wants to explain what I got wrong there, feel free. But if we look here, bad example, because that's the meat fridge. If we look here, 150 is what it takes to make this 30 out of 30, right? 150. This. So the max it can hold is 150 in its 30 of capacity. This is now 30 of 30 with two sacks of 75 cabbages each. So it's exactly the same. Oh yeah, let's make sure I have with me. I was gonna say metal work and stuff, but I don't even know where I'm keeping that. Oh, I think it's on the um I think it's at the back there, you know. I'm just gonna assume I'm gonna remember. Let's just go to bed. Decent night's sleep for once. Another foggy day. Thank you very much for watching. Really hope you enjoyed. If you did, do let me know by leaving a like down below. Subscribe if you do want to see more, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye bye.